hey welcome back to the course in this lecture we will talk about best placements for adsense ads first of all google after you uh, after you our account uh, has been approved by google team so and you are using google adsense ads on your site so google will uh, send you emails and recommendation tips about how to uh, which kind of ads you should use on your website and where you should use so you will also get from Google but I I will be telling you something uh, really I have experimented myself you should add Google ads to your website in the placements where people can actually click on the ads I mean which uh, the areas on your website which get people's attention at first I mean uh, get attention from the visitors at first when they visit your site so for example I, I will visit my website online store.com I click this so I am on my website now my first attention always goes to this header or anyone who is coming to your website their attention will go to this header so you must have one ad unit here AdSense allows you to add three ad units these big units to your uh, website I mean to any page of your website to one single page you can add three ad units whether big or small and also you can add three link units so this place is somewhere get first attention because when you come to this page this area which you see at first is called about the fold area which gets the most attention of people and when you scroll scroll down so this is the rest of the page but without going uh, below I mean without using this uh, scroller whatever you see this is called above the fold area so here you must have an ad unit in at the top this is very uh, you know important because people may click this at first attention if they see something interesting I mean an ad related to your site or if you don't have any header then do use uh, the ad unit after the navigation bar that is also clickable and get attention of people so if I was not using this ad unit I would use an ad unit just below this navigation bar here in this area now the next very important place is this sidebar the first spot of this sidebar where right now I have my own campaign about my uh, courses in uh, Hindi and Urdu but if you add an ad unit to this place this is also getting too much attention of the visitor and they can click it if there is something interesting now this is the home page I have added another ad unit here this is optional if you add or not because it will also get people's attention when they scroll down uh, on your page and you can also add an ad unit to this area not this footer but this area just below the content on the home page only or you can add another ad unit because you can add three units so on the home page I only have two one is here and one is this one but I can also add one ad unit uh, just above this here or between these articles here in between or here uh, at the bottom of this page but <coughs> the more money as in the single post now when I click a single post so there will be another ad unit this one this is the third one now I will have three ads on the same page this one this one so when visitor is visiting this page my website's page single page so first of all they will uh, this ad will the, uh, will get the attention of that visitor so if they click this it's okay I will get money in my account but if they miss that one so they can click this one you must add an ad unit whether this small one or a big one but as I told you <coughs> uh, while I was uh, 
teaching you how you can add a new add unit or how can create a new add unit always select responsive side but before that your website design or template must also be responsive so this this will work best for you i am using this three add units this one is responsive this one is responsive and this was uh, this one is also responsive so i am using responsive ads now you can see this is also responsive this is also responsive so different people will see different type of ads now the person is coming uh, on the page below now here i have another ad unit if this is interesting to people they will click this but if you don't want to use this ad then you can use one ad just after finishing the article so if the person has finished the article again there will be a chance to click on the ad but at the same time i will also recommend you to use this ad also and add links unit here because you are allowed to use adsense three ad units the big ones and three link units which are only links you can add one or two links here to this area and also you can use uh, this ad unit which is a vertical one you can use a horizontal one after exactly this article place because these are the areas which Google has told me over the past four to five years these are the areas people will click mostly this area just uh, below the I mean this title because whenever they will come to this page they will see oh this is a very good thing and there will be some very related relevant aid from Google so they can uh, they can click it immediately and after that this and then below here you can see this is also the area when the person is going to finish the article so there is another chance for the ad to be clicked anyways now these were the placements and there is a site mobile if you write mobile test me you will see this site mobile test dot me dot this is not dot com this is dot me I can just tell you you can uh, use this website to test your website on different mobile de mobile devices this is the desktop version of my site now I will simply copy this URL and will paste it here I mean I will say okay I'm w I want to see my site on this mobile well paste the URL click go and see here that ad this one this one this big one or here on the desktop has become what is very smaller one on the mobile because my website theme is a responsive theme as well as the ad since ad units are responsive so they are automatically adjusting now I will go scroll down in here you can see this is the title of the post this one and after the title you can see the ad is very very smaller size this is only because of the responsive uh, ad size I have selected and Google Adsense account so this is a great way because you can get clicks from mobiles from desktops from tablets from different devices and you will make more money of course see here person can read easily the article and can after that I have you know all the things here the comments and this is the aid of the sidebar below here this is also responsive so if I go to another one for example this uh, this one Apple iPad you can see the aids are again responsive in this mobile phone this is the top eight now this is the single eight here automatically adjust it and the rest of the site and things very nicely it will be working and you will get money from different devices you can see here if I show you my website here you know it is saying uh, desktop earning is this one high-end mobile device is this and tablets this so every day you see your earning you will see 
how much earning is coming from desktops and how much earning is coming from mobile devices so therefore <coughs> you can test your website on these all phones if that is responsive working properly or not if not working properly then you need to fix all the things related to responsive uh, responsiveness anyways the best placement the final summary for this is the best placement uh, placements are those placements where people can go and click and those areas or placements can get attention of people so that is the first one is this one second is this one after that the sidebar wherever this is the most clickable area you can add here as well but if that is not available then add here or it just after finishing the article or post so these four areas are the best places to insert ads and ads and make much more money so that's it now in next video we'll talk about which ads and ad units to use stay tuned